I like the fact there's no DLC. You just make friends, you know, mind control them and brainwash them. I really like that tone. It really makes me happier. Even though I'm sure the, the message is that Talion brainwashed them forever ago and they just pissed off for a bit. Still, I like that. Eltario has been commanded to wear the new ring by Galadriel, which enhances her power, but she refuses to wield it for domination. Which I do like. It's a nicer turn and touch to it. Although the fact that he should say, Oh, she was forced to wear it by her master. No, she put that shit on when she got pally with Keller Brimbundle, and they stabbed me in the arsehole. <laughs> ah, Jesus Christ! My lady, I have searched every corner of Mordor for you. Yes, that's why you've been on this island the entire time, which can be proved by the army screen. I never imagined you would be so... so in... Chanting. I've just realized you- <laughs> Smile! I just noticed his goddamn headdress, that's cute as hell. I pledge myself, here and now, to you! <laughs> that's an indecent <laughs> proposal, my boy. I like that one! I like how they're following me around, this is so cool! Making a really personalized army and taking them everywhere with you! This is what the main game should have been! Wait, what? Whoa, what? Wait, what? I didn't know you were a captain! <laughs> Excuse me? I'm sorry, Fog! I didn't mean to do that! I, I really didn't! Whoa! What the hell? Oh. oh! How the hell did you not take his head off with that? Borderline caved his helmet in at the very least. Trying to sneak into the keep, are you? Did you really think the Overlord would leave it unguarded after the key got nicked? Well, yeah. My mistress demands the She-Elf be unharmed. She has sent me and her children to ensure this. You know, it suddenly dawned on me. How are you she best friend when you're wearing one of her children as a frilly hat? Oh, how many goddamn heads can we have squeezed off? He was a torturer, and he got let off easy. That should be a life lesson, all right? You should have done something much worse to him. Enraged? Oh, he's sad because his friend died. Come on, have a heart. Don't just mercilessly end him. I just said! I'll tell you what, Spider-Man. You can Peter Park your ass right there. You're staying with me. You're a keeper. The maggots defending this fort was soft. Touching it from them was too easy. Perhaps the others will be more of a challenge. <laughs> now you'll find out what happens when you don't pay your dues. Oh. Well, that's actually kind of cool. <laughs> the reason he's so mad is God and dedicated did all the work. I know the feeling and half the goddamn shit I go through. I feel for you, man. Uh, Jim, coming in the mad fat wild though. Flash, stay away! Wow, that was intimidating. Ah, stay away! Where there's smoke, there's fire, and where there's fire, there'll soon be smoke rising up from a pink-skinned corpse. Was was that supposed to be clever? Because if it is. Pardon the namesake pun, but, uh, you got to be kidding me! This is gonna be very embarrassing for you in a moment, isn't it? Yep, you're enraged! Your final moment was to be empowered, and you still got headbanged to death! Of all the Dark Lord's dominion, this is its very heart. Is it because it's the place that hoses the one with the big eye? Fucking probably, isn't it? Would you go to the University of Stating the fucking obvious?! The Digger is working to destroy a rival's tunnels. Choose a side in this underground war. When you say choose a side, do you mean the game will and it'll pick the one it's named as opposed to the unnamed rival? Ooh, man, edge me sheet. Which one will it pick? Did you just... Oh, that's what you meant by digger. Everything moving around up here makes an horrible racket down below. Down below? Wh did you just say down below when you just saw him climb up from the dirt? Dear God, I found something duller than the ground I'm walking on. You are standing in the way of my masterwork! What the- I am standing for those you would crush beneath your infernal industry! And soon they too will rise against you! Please don't get mad at my pretty architect, I like him. Side with the architect to the digger? Fuck right off! Go in with the architect, look at him! He looks bloody amazing, he's the Gandalf of the Ologs! Fuck you, you weird thing! I mean, don't get me wrong, you were really cool looking and I'm gonna be sad to see you go, but he's 
blue, you're red. Why would I pick the fucking red boy? Madness! What is voice? Jesus, he just went higher than the space shuttles. Man, you motherfucker. I got elven rage. You can't stop this. Elf Skull give it to you. Oh, that poor boy. That was a nice little fancy jump. Oh, my God. He just got a rock lobbed at him. My architect picked up a pile of dirt and hammered it at his skull. The battle for Mordor begins. He's hoping that this doesn't revolve around Talion being useless. Undead Citadel. Ah, it's been upgraded. Uh, we're going to get a downgrade when this individual wins, I imagine. It's just going to be the destroyed Citadel. Feels bad. Because my architect teabags nothing. You stand before walls you could not defend and will not breach. Oh, have you know, actually, if it were me behind the uh, the controlling little potion there, I would have defended it perfectly. I wouldn't have gone down for nothing. Can we just hold up for a second? What would actually be, be better or worse? Sauron being the, the, the owner, the lord of, of the Middle Earth? Or those two? Wouldn't it be easier to beat them if we let them take down Sauron? Like, I'm not even kidding. Uh, I'm thinking that's, that's the timeline we missed out on here. Letting the Nazgul win for a bit, waiting for them the week and everything, and then coming in and killing them. I don't know. Seems logical to me. Project Foreigner! You turn around and march your army out now! Or I kill your mate here! Got one word for you, maggot! Oh no. No! Don't! No! At least I can actually say this seriously and it means something. At least he died doing something he loved. Unlike that boy who died being scurried off by a spider. All right, then I've, I've, you win some, lose some. God fucking damn it. Why did you kill the one I liked? The fortress will soon be yours, my lady. Yes, it will. Th thank you, whoever the hell just said that to me. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait, why is it Eltario's fortress? Why is it Italian's? He's the one sacrificing his soul. Oh, I hate this. Excuse me, sir. Why are you nearly dead when we've only just turned up? N no, no introduction. <laughs> nope, no introduction for him. Apparently this is the cast of Snatch, because they fucking ate pikeys. All right, fellas, congratulations. Oh no. Oh, Talion, for fuck's sake. <laughs> what are you doing? Seriously, man. You were bested by this bitch at the beginning. You lost your own fort that we're taking back. And now you've broken like this. Oh, <laughs> this, is the, this is before the final stage. Where we have to fight the Nazgul sisters, you and I. Two on two. Tornado tag rules. This is for the belts, man. It's gonna put us on regional goddamn news. Get the fuck unstuck, you bloody numpty. Go on. Fucking <laughs> idiots. I'm very sorry for the loss of your brother. You seem to have dealt with it very well, though. I guess with Tinder just being the sole survivor, you're gonna have to try and swipe right on a few more people to make your blood brother. You have come far, Elf. Oh, I'm glad you've noticed. We thank you for bringing us the ring. You, you're welcome? Oh. Ah, oh dear. BDSM, whips and chains. I don't do well with this. Whoa! Why did I just go crash Bandicoot there? I didn't even mean to do that. And it's over for you. Have a good day, bitch. Bye bye now! You didn't even. That was an unblockable attack and you still missed, you fucking fanny! We will return in time to see the newest. My hand is inside your head. Your words have no merit. The ring will possess you. Oh, is that why there's always Nazgul? Because the people that kill them take the rings and then become the new one. That's a big army. You better take them off. Be smart now. At least in front of this entire army, take them off. Oh, it's too late. Ah, shit. Hey, Talion! Why are you limping off? Take the ring. Now. You will not get another chance. Yes, betray me again. Put the knife in my back! Don't let me die in this cursed land. Oh wait, no, that's that's perfect backstabbing position. I can't say I trust this. You told me once when the time came you would do what is needed. Give me the ring. If you do that, you bleed out right on the spot. Remember that. Not gonna do it, is he? He's been corrupted. 
My guy's the bad guy. I've wanted it the entire time, but now I'm not playing as him. Now I'm just going to kill him! You're gonna break my heart! I have fought this war alone. Italian, you are not alone. I was for 85% of the goddamn time! You can't turn up at the end and then say you're on my side! This ring is mine. And Italian is no more. Are you joking my dick off? All right, no, I didn't like him. No, no, it's fine. Just put, just put him down. Just put him the rest. Put him to bed. No. El Tariel, the betrayer, is the good guy. Italian, the guy who's been through it all for two games. Bad guy. Great. Lovely. I am just the biggest air conditioning unit of this. Thank you for the random immersion breaking fucking achievement by the way. Bye. This is not the ending that I wanted. This is not what I was expecting from this. This is... How do I go back to the Shadow Wars after I kill me? How does this timeline work? You fight. Kevin Bacon? Jesus Christ, you're a monster. You will accept your fate. You've been knocked on your butt. That's your final word? Confidence? <sighs> Love to accept mine, but I'm, I'm, I'm too busy battling the idea of actually killing you. Please tell me you just escape, lift a fight another day, and kill her instead. May you gain some freedom in death. His health bar wasn't empty. He's alive. I am banished from death and bound to the flaming eye. Wait. Is that it? Oh, I'm dead. Oh no, I'm actually. <sighs> oh yes, back when I looked like a gorilla. Good. Aye. It's nice to relive these memories, you know, of the protagonist we've just killed in the first DLC of the game when there's another one coming. What? What? Your work here is done. But where's the ring? We will go into the West. It, if, if the work's done, wouldn't the ring be on the ground or something? Or in her hand? Not yet. In the years that followed, Eltariel continued to fight the forces of darkness. Huh? She traveled east, and she returned to Mordor many times. Oh yeah? Oh. She witnessed the fall of Barad-dûr and the escape of Celebrimbor. Excuse me, I'm sorry, what? Uh, well, there he goes, Casper the Friendly ghosting away, as you do. The Ringmaker is free. Yes, and the subtitles were very late. Wait, I thought that was the ring you just destroyed! He calls to you. You kept that one? I will follow his call. Did you just equal bait me after killing Talion and with her as the potential main protagonist? Oh, I... I think there's gonna be an ruckus about this one. <laughs> That's it the video! If you enjoyed that confusing end to a DLC, then thank you very much! Please do like the video and let me know, because I want you... What the hell? And feel free to watch the other video on screen and follow me on Twitter to keep up to date with shit. Now, I do Twitch every goddamn day these days. Tune in that! You can see my confusion live. Thank you for much watching this. And I'll see you in the next one.